is mourning this two year old boy who drowned on the west side. This is a new picture of Aiden. His grandmother told us today it happened in minutes. Action News Jack's Brittany Verner spoke with another local mother who almost lost her own child and is now encouraging others about pool safety. I spoke with the grandma earlier this morning. She was here babysitting that young child when this happened. She was obviously too distraught to speak with us on camera, but she told me she's no longer going to be able to live here after this tragic incident. Losing a child is something no parent is ever prepared to deal with. Thursday, the grandmother of this two-year-old boy, Aiden, says she was forced to face that horrible reality when he got out of the house and jumped into her backyard pool and drowned. It's a terrible accident, a terrible thing that happens way too often. Ashley Thompson says she can empathize with the family because she, too, almost had to live through what this family is now experiencing. She coded three times. Luckily, her incident wasn't fatal, but she has since made it her mission to educate other parents about pool safety education. People don't think it's going to happen to them until it does happen to them. The grandmother of the two-year-old who drowned told Action News Jax her grandson and his brother had been visiting her from New York for the past few weeks and within a matter of minutes their quality time spit became a memory it's something thompson says changes your life forever when i heard the story yesterday i just i, I couldn't help but cry for that poor family now ashley is sending encouraging words to that family for the loss of little aiden and they can't blame themselves and you know, it's it's an unfortunate accident. When I spoke with the grandma earlier today, she also told me that she's encouraging other parents to get your children swimming lessons as early as possible to prevent a tragedy like this from happening. Reporting in the Lakeshore area, Brittany Verner, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jax. In May, Action News Jax Beth Rousseau, Rousseau showed you a local swim school, which is teaching kids to swim as young as two years old. The class also teaches kids how to turn over on their backs to float if they get too tired to make it to safety. To see that story again, go to actionnewsjax.com.